Hello, my name is Dr. Azmi bin Muhammad Tamil. I am here to help you register your Google ID at the Google Scholar. First, go to Google Scholar and log in using your official PPUKM or Gmail email account. Click on, citation, click on My Citations and fill up the displayed form. Then click on Next. Okay. As you can see here, I've already logged in using my official email account from PPUKM. So now I click on My Citations. I am given this form. So please click in all the necessary information. Please use University Kebangsaan Malaysia, not National University of Malaysia. Okay, once done, click on next step. Okay, as you can see here, you, they have found your articles that you have written and now you only have to add them to your profile. Okay, so what do you do? You have a look at it. You see all the articles. Okay. Once you have, when you have looked at it, you make sure all of them are related to your own publication. Once you're happy with it, click on Add. Okay. So you can see here, here everything has been listed. So let's go back. Here's another one. Okay, using a different email account. Okay, so now all the articles are already inside my profile. Click on next step. Okay. Here you have to choose how you want this list of articles to be updated, whether it is automatic or not automatically. Okay, so once you have chosen the type of update, you can go to your profile. So the only, the thing that you have to do is you have to make it public and take note of the Google ID. So the Google ID is something like this in the address bar. Okay, so this is your profile. As you can see, my name is there. But currently it is private. So what you should do, you should make it public. Okay, now it is public. At, at the top here is your Google profile. You can change your photo. Okay, so you can go and find a, a suitable photo for your for your profile. So you just click change your photo. Okay. 
So you can see your photo being changed here. If there are articles that are missing from this uh, citation, just click on add. Okay, so when you click on add, you can add articles manually, okay, or by groups. So what you do, you click on add articles. So these are articles that they have listed. Okay, as you can see, I have two more articles here. So I can add these two articles. Okay. Why it was not listed earlier? Because the way the my name was cited, so it, rather than my name, they are citing my father's name. Okay. So here you have, you have another one, Azmi MT. So you click this one, yes, yes, yes. Add. You can search for new articles. And well, what is important here? We want you to look for this user ID. We want you to copy it and send it to the Secretary of Research.